Hey guys, what's going on? It's Vic here, back with another Madden 22 video. In today's episode, we're getting back into the Atlanta Falcons franchise. And just letting you guys know, I do have a different mic and a different audio input, I believe it is. Yes, audio. Yes, audio input, not output. My bad. So let me know how it sounds. I'm pretty sure this mic is just my headset mic. It's not my original mic that I use, so I'm pretty sure it doesn't sound as good. So let me know. I would appreciate it. But we're here to face the 5 and 10 Buffalo Bills. Honestly, I'm considering throwing this game because we have the six pick in the draft. I'm pretty sure we'll have a better pick if we beat the Bills. And I'm very guaranteed that we will have a worse pick if we lose to them. Matter of fact, I, I really want to lose to them. So I think, but at the same time, like even if I didn't want to lose them, it's not like I could beat them anyways. They have Josh Allen and I also have, you know, a 58 overall QB uh, at my lineup right now. So uh, I'm going to be relying on Naheem Hines, 56 overall QB, my bad. And um, yeah, that's all I really got to say, man. This, this team is just terrible. And uh, yeah, can't wait to get to the offseason. The playoff picture, don't even need to do that. Did all the scouting that I wanted, completed all the points, training complete, managed staff. Let's just get into the game. What we can do with Flood here. That's going to be open. There we go. Good win. Off to the races. How did you catch him? Dang. Felipe Franks with the dime, though. First down. Moving it to the left side. Great block by the fullback. Naheem Hines has space up the field. Swerves out the safety. He's off to the races. Nobody's going to catch him. Clear lane. Naheem Hines. Touchdown. Probably one of the longest runs he's had all season. He barely gets the ball. Well, he barely gets good blocking up the field. That was a perfect block by the fullback. Absolutely love it. Ninth touchdown in the season. Definitely broke over 1,400 yards. Amazing. Got this covered for the time being. Over the middle. Lockdown. I'm right. Let's go. Let's go. Use your pick. Let's go. Move it. Deion Jones right in front of his face. He's going to throw at me. Pick six. Let's go. I'm not trying to throw this game. Finally. Finally. I didn't spaz out whenever the ball comes toward me. Even if they throw. He threw it directly at me. I was clearly covering him. And it bounces off his fingertips apparently. It bounces off the back of my head. And I catch. I would have been so pissed if that was not a pick, dude. Holy crap. That was cool. It is going to be a run. It's going to be a run to the outside. I'm going to get there with the right. And he's going to be stopped behind the line of scrimmage by Dante Jackson, who's actually making a play. It is going to be a run. I'm coming in hard for the blitz. I'm right there in the backfield for the blitz with Murray. Zach Moss, negative two yards. Seeing if we can have Kyle Pitts here, potentially. I think we can get that there. Felipe Franks, oh, under pressure, inaccurate bullet pass. That's going to be fourth down. We're going to have to punt. Come on, it's going to be a run play. They're going to move it to the outside. I'm going to get pancaked. Zach Moss is off to the races. Zach Moss throws off one guy, and I miss a tackle. Zach Moss going to get 23 yards on that rush. You're locking down everything here. Come on, what was that angle? Oh, my gosh, Emmanuel Sanders. Uh, tackle him, Gary and Conley. There we go. Nice tackle before the end zone. That was weird how that DB just completely whiffed that on Emmanuel Sanders. If I can watch the replay on that. Just really quickly. I'm not going to complain about this too much. But, um, yeah, that was just, it was terrible angle, terrible pursuit by whoever 23 was. Murray, the strong safety. Just I know I switched on here, but I didn't switch on until... Like, I switched on here and I dived. Because I easily thought that would player lock and dive. But it doesn't, I guess. It's going to be a run play to Zach Moss. Wide gap. Wow, that was a run play with that kind of a spread? Wow, okay. Zach Moss, touchdown. Come on. There we go. Big hit. Let's go. Oliver. Isaiah Oliver laid out Stefan Diggs. <laughs> oh, my gosh. What a game by this defense. Special teams off Naheem Hines offense. Defensive pick six. Now special teams make it a play. Holy. Wasn't commentating because it's a punt, you know. You don't expect anything to happen. I switch on. Boom. Nailed. Absolutely destroyed Stefan Diggs. Sent him to a different planet. That's got to be the thumbnail. Mm, Zach Moss probably gonna try and go over there. Ah, I was covering him for a little bit, then not too much after that. Zach Moss another first down. He's really tearing us up. Mm, got this covered right here. The check down. 
Both of them are check downs. Pick it, pick it, pick it. There we go. Use your pick. Use your pick. Let's go. I'm on the mark today. I got hit sticks. Two picks and a pick six today. Let's go. My second user pick. Let's go up the middle. Naheem Hines. He's got a lot of space. Naheem Hines off to the races once again. Swerving in, out. They can't touch his feet. Showboat. Naheem Hines. Two touchdowns in one game. Two massive runs. That has to be his longest rush on the year. This has to be our best first half performance ever. 28 nothing blowout. And Josh Allen's rolling out. He's not going to have... Come on, pick it, pick it, pick it. Once again, Murray, back to back. Let's go. Let's user picks. My third user pick on the day. Murray with the second interception. Let's go, Josh Allen. He, he's getting nervous, man. <laughs> it's a Naheem Hines inside zone. Great blocks up the field. Naheem Hines once again. First down. Eight rushes, 145 yards and two touchdowns. What is stat line? What is his average? I want to check that. What is this man's average stats? Go to game stats right now. Go to player stats. Rushing. 18 per carry. My God. Giving this to Naheem Hines once again. Great blocks up the field. Keep moving. Swerves out the DB. It's stop and go. Oh, I was trying to hit a stop and go, but then I remembered it's a CPU. Still 10 rushes, 165 yards. Side zone once again, Naheem Hines. Great blocks up the field. Dude, these blocks are so perfect today. My gosh. It's to Naheem Hines once again. Give me some blocks. Come on. To the outside. Naheem Hines. Third touchdown on the day. I think he should probably be the thumbnail player. Best, best performance this team has ever had the entire year. But at the same time, that hit stick, that hit stick punt was like a once in a lifetime thing. Like, probably 200 yards, three touchdowns. What a career performance for Naheem Hines. You're going to play underneath or over the middle? He's going to go deep. Dante Jackson, pick it. There we go. Josh Allen's fourth pick on the day. Take it back, Dante Jackson. Change of possession. 11 seconds left. I think we can get in field goal range. Another user pick for me. My fourth user pick. Move out. Move up the field. Come on. Slide. No, no, no. He's going to fumble too. I was just trying to get in field goal range. Don't let him take it back. Don't let him take it back. What do you do? No. Levi Wallace. Zero seconds left. Oh. I was trying to slide, but I think it ended up making me dive. They change the slide button every year, and it pisses me off. And there we go. Come on. Oh, no. That's not going to be a run play. Josh Allen goes down. Bullard. With a, no, is it Bullard is how you pronounce it, I believe? No, David, that's Marlon Davidson, not Bullard, my bad. Marlon Davidson with the sack. Looking for Kyle Pitts on fourth down, come on, just get it there, get it there. Thank you, Felipe Franks. Kyle Pitts up the field on fourth down. That's exactly what I was looking for. I'm sure there's other options, but I just wanted to get the first down. Once again, going to give it to Naheem Hines. Great blocks once again. Moving up the field. Calvin Ridley with an amazing block. Gives Naheem Hines his fourth touchdown on the day. Naheem Hines. Four TDs. He's, he's going to break 300 yards in one game. He's going to set a record, boys. It's going to be a pass play. I got to cover the flat to the outside. And the blitz comes in. Deion Jones. He has an interception, a sack, and a touchdown. Let's go. Giving it to Naheem Hines once again. Move up the field, Naheem Hines. Barely good enough blocks. Move. Oh, I keep forgetting stop and go does not work with the CPU. Dang it. Hopefully they're in man coverage. I think they are in man coverage. Calvin Ridley, hit this on the run. Hit this on the run. Keep moving up field. Calvin Ridley, touchdown. I would have rather had Naheem Hines had a touchdown, but Felipe Franks gets a touchdown too. Great pass. I guess that's him, his way of making up for the missed easy touchdown he could have got at halftime that resulted in a fumble touchdown. But either way, great pass on the run sidearm. Matt Ryan could never. Deion Jones coming in for the heater blitz. Oh, no. I guess I took the angle way too bad. Come on, Gary and Conley. Thank you for the tackle. I switched on to take the angle to tackle Zach Moss, but Zach Moss is the only problem for us in the entire day. It's not going to be a run play. I'm still going to have to guard the middle. I can't guard both those. I just got caught up really quickly. 
K covering over the middle. Nothing is happening right now over the middle. Pick that, pick that, pick th What are you doing? Oh my gosh, Richie Grant. I'm spamming Y. I mean, considering that he's already thrown four picks today, I guess EA can throw the Bills a bone, but I was right in front of that spamming Y, and he just looked at him the entire play. Up the gut, third and three, Naheem Hines. Great blocks up the field, directly up the middle. Is that, yep, 309 yards. Is that a record in a game? Most rushing yards? I don't know. Blood. Goodwin is going to be open here. Good job. Move up the field. Goodwin, first down. It to Naheem Hines. Bounce this one to the outside. There we go. Naheem Hines shakes off a blocker. Shakes off two. He's going to get in there for his fifth touchdown on the day. And I'm pretty sure that touch ties the record for the most touchdowns in a game. 56 to 21. Naheem Hines, record breaker. Oh my gosh, what a game. We need to overview the stats. First of all, Felipe Franks wasn't that bad. I had a passer rating of uh, 106, but he only had 11 attempts. And the reason, that's because he just missed that Calvin Ridley pass. And I was just like, nah, I, I can't deal with that. So uh, he was good whenever we needed him, like desperately needed him. He's just not like your go-to guy that's reliable. Also, I did not know he was six foot six. That is interesting. Um, one touchdown, zero interceptions, unlike Josh Allen, who was terrible. I mean, 199 yards, I guess, and a touchdown, but 61 pass rating is not it. Naheem Hines. This has to be some kind of record. Like, I have to pause to think about this. And before you guys say, oh, you just, you just force-fed him the ball. You just force-fed 9.6 per carry. Almost averaged 10 yards per carry. That is almost unheard of, dude. Holy. 327 yards, 5 TDs. And I'm pretty sure that ties the record for the most rushing touchdowns in a game. Didn't even fumble. Broke two tackles on the same play. Two, four, four plays with plus 20 yards. Uh, yards at the carry. Wait, where's his longest run? Longest was 67 yards. Receiving wise, like they they have all of it. But uh, at least Calvin Ridley got a touchdown. One five yards after catch, and I believe he only had one reception the entire game. Yeah, one for 24 yards with that TD that I threw. And that was literally it. So uh, yeah, the best game of the season that we've ever had, no doubt. Okay, so we're going to be facing the 10-6 and six New Orleans Saints. Please tell me my draft pick did not go down. Please tell me it didn't. Oh, wait, no, my draft pick did go down. That's a good thing. How did... That doesn't make any sense. I beat the Buffalo Bills, who are 5-11, and 11, and we're 5-11. and 11, Therefore, our pick should go up, and we should have, like, the 7th or 8th pick. But for some reason... Okay. I mean, I guess I'm not going to complain. Okay, uh, James Ross is looking better and better, and I might honestly trade back in the draft because look how many first-round QBs are projected to go in front of him. I might trade back in the draft. That's up to you guys. So, um, yeah, and uh, upgrade players here. We got the upgrade players, Naheem Hines, of course. Naheem Hines should get like a whole five whole upgrades, dude. This shouldn't even be close, but we're going to upgrade him into elusive back, of course. Just amazing game. Carrying, change of direction, juke move, spin move. That's kind of what I expected. Insane, dude. I'm pretty sure this is a contract year, and I'm pretty sure we signed him at the beginning of the year. Franchise staff points. I want to get this into the budding commander. So do this. You have to keep... Oh, uh, you have to do that one too. I'm going to need more franchise staff points. I need to get to budding commander to increase my QB gains for James Rouse. And, um... Yeah, I absolutely love everything we have. My gosh. What a game for everybody one game away from the offseason and seeing james rouse in a falcons uniform by the way look at the contested division the buccaneers are 10 and 6 saints are 10 and 6 panthers are 10 and 6 all of their upcoming upcoming games matter bro because we could be the deciding factor whether or not the saints make the playoffs next week but um i don't quite know about that also weekly awards let's see it where is he Deion Jones also gets a weekly award. How is... Oh, it's been Tom Brady and Dak Prescott the entire year for the uh, offensive player. But um, week 17, Naheem Hines. Definitely, that's a record. Deion Jones, four tackles, one sack, one interception, one TD. No surprise there. Insane for him. And looking into the stats and awards. Come on, show me. It's still 32nd best offense. Show me he's number one. Come on, show me, show me him. 
Second for rushing yards, eighth in rushing TDs. I can deal with that. Let's see where he's at. He has to be in the conversation. Naheem Hines, ninth for MVP. NF's best running back. He's going to be third for the best running back in his conference. Nice. Nice. I want to look at these stats one more time. Come on, boys. I know I'm holding you here. You can click off the video if you want to, but why would you want to, boys? Why would you want to? Naheem Hines is so close. He's 17 whole yards away from tying with Nick Chubb, but Nick Chubb's probably going to get 100 yards next game, but he's five whole touchdowns away from getting his touch. Dang, bro. That's unfortunate. Should have gotten more earlier. Who has the best average in the league? That doesn't count. Felipe Franks has the best average in the league, boys. Um, uh, Barkley, third. Dave Montgomery, 15, 14, 14, 14, 13. Nice. Okay, that's nice, boys. That is very, very nice. In the conversation for MVP season, most rushing TDs in a game. What? No, 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 in a game, not a season. I was about to say 28 rushing TDs that existed. Okay. E Nevers, E Never. Who is the fullback from 1929? Holds the record with 2020 Alvin Kamara for six touchdowns in a game. I thought Alvin Kamara had five rushing touchdowns and one receiving touchdown. I guess I was wrong. But Naheem Hines has tied with some of the greats. He is tied for third place for the most rushing touchdowns in a game. Awesome. What about rushing yards? Naheem Hines has the record for the most rushing yards in a game by a mile compared to 2007 Adrian Peterson. Nobody has ever broken over 300 yards rushing yards in a game. And he broke it by a mile. My gosh. Breaking records, Naheem Hines. That is a perfect way to end off this video. I thank you guys all for watching. Hope you guys all enjoyed. And apart from that, boys, I'll see you guys all in the next one.